Elise? Elise, hi. David. You know, I rode the M6 to work every day for three years, hoping that I'd bump into you. Uh, uh, listen, is there a place we could go and, um, and talk? Don't you have to get to work or something? I just got sick. I haven't seen you in three years. You make me sick. That's not an ideal come on, just so you know. <laughs> what are you looking for? No, I just uh, felt like someone was watching us. Uh, hey, uh, uh, Charlie, I'm going to have to skip breakfast, and I probably have to postpone the speech, too. I just bumped into Elise. You just hung up on your friend. Yeah, but we've known each other since we were kids. What we speech? have a shorthand. Doesn't matter. You want to take a walk? No. We have a lot to catch up on. I don't on. think you should cancel your speech. What if I don't like you at the end of our walk? I'll take my chances. Well, seriously, my number hasn't changed. Just call me like you didn't last time. <laughs> Look, if you take a walk with me, I'll explain why. It's been years. How do you know I don't have a nice boyfriend? Uh, do you have a nice boyfriend? Would it matter if I did? Yeah. Oh, so you don't have any real conviction, then? Okay, it wouldn't matter at all. Oh, so, you don't, so you don't mind being a homewrecker? <laughs> Congressman! Like How you doing, man? I'm from Red Hook. You're the best. Thank you. Good to see you. Okay, if you were married, then it would bother me. But now you're just saying what you 